Well, we continue our focus on jobs, and especially our young people, and how they think about their futures. Manufacturing jobs are so different today. Instead of factories, think labs. Apprenticeships can take a new high school graduate and guide them towards a successful future without a four-year college degree and all that debt that often comes along with it. As we continue our American Graduate Getting to Work series, we introduce you to two young people with bright futures. Carolina Impact's Tanisha Johnson has details. High-tech, computerized machines are doing the hard work these days at Chiron America, a specialized manufacturing company here in Charlotte. Manufacturing isn't what it used to be when our parents were growing up. It's not dark, it's not dirty, it's not dangerous. It's advanced, it's technological, it's challenging, and it's clean. Manufacturing today in companies like Chiron means making parts that go inside complex machines. Machines like cell phones, kitchen appliances, and even automotive parts like sleek rims for a car. What they make is so proprietary that we can't show you specifics or even tell you the companies these parts are made for. So much of this world is computerized. With the touch of a button, it's precise and fast. In minutes, specialists can make a product or create custom machinery to allow companies to make their own devices. Instructors at CPCC's new Advanced Technology Center say exposure to this industry is key for students so they understand the process of advanced manufacturing. Just enables us to produce goods at a, a more efficient and a more economical rate. It's all about creating and problem solving using engineering skills, be it mechanical or electrical. And it draws talented students like Devin Hendry and Kaylee Loist from CPCC's Apprenticeship 2000 program. Just knowing that the parts that I've actually worked on um, are going out and being used in the real world is uh, a really cool thing to think about. It, like I contributed to society in a really big way. I actually learn something every single day that I leave my job. and. I'm um, just two and a half months in, I've learned so much. Apprenticeship 2000 guides students to earn a computer machining or a mechatronics degree. That's mechanical engineering and electronics wrapped up into one. The cost of education is included and they're paid for working and learning at companies like Chiron. Once they become full-time employees, the starting minimum salary is $36,000 a year. 21-year-old Danry Menzenares is on that path. He now helps to oversee the apprenticeship program at Chiron and helps students like Joey Fesha. Our companies want to keep that knowledge and that wealth in the company, so what better way than to help people pass on that torch to the next generation. Now in his second year, Fesha says he's becoming a jack of all trades, which isn't a bad thing when you're learning. Not only am I building my knowledge for the industry, I'm building myself as a person. Mechatronics professor John Gresser says they can't get students into apprenticeships fast enough. The demand is definitely outstripping the supply so far because um, uh, they're, they're, they're constantly advertising for, for positions in, in this area. So Far, Chiron has a 100% employee retention rate as a result of the apprenticeship program. Their goal for the future? To keep bringing in at least two to four apprentices each year in an effort to build their overall company and its leadership. Chiron recruiter Robert Shook says the apprenticeship is a great way to help close the skills gap between millennials and baby boomers. We need to pass on that talent and the experience that we've learned to these apprentices so that they're ready to take up the mantle and be those future leaders. There are currently 140 students in apprenticeships at CPCC. Many students on tour this day are learning of this for the first time and seem intrigued. Like, that's so interesting and like, I'm a person who wants to help other people, so like for me to have this opportunity right in front of me, like, I wanna take it. Another benefit of training workers here in Charlotte Companies will stay because the pipeline of future employees is here. They can automate the systems and have the uh, the trained personnel that they, they can find here in the States with the, uh, the types of programs we have. Uh, it's going to encourage them to stay here and, and leave their man manufacturing in the States. The key to the future of complex manufacturing is breaking the stigma of factory work so it has greater appeal to a new generation. Companies like Chiron have invested in Charlotte and want employees from here. 
and institutions like CPCC are key in finding the qualified students and exposing them to jobs that exist now and will advance into the future. For Carolina Impact, I'm Tanisha Johnson reporting. Thanks so much, Tanisha. There are two different apprenticeship pathways at Central Piedmont Community College. One is called Apprenticeship 2000 and the other is Charlotte Apprenticeship.